Is it your testimony that we are today utilizing all of the facilities available in America that could provide that kind of controlled uh, research uh, environment? No, we prob probably could do some more. Why aren't we doing it? Is it your testimony that we are today utilizing all of the facilities available in America that could provide that kind of controlled uh, research uh, environment? No, we prob probably could do some more. Why aren't we doing it? I think one of the reasons probably would be that the limited resources. Money. That's a resource. Right. Okay. But you're talking about funds. Yes. Okay. Right. It's important all of us in the public service uh, try to speak uh, language everybody can understand, and I don't mean that in a disrespectful way. Well, that, that states it rather simply, uh, clearly, and it's not, it's not my point to say the only issue is money. It isn't. But it's also to make it clear that we're dealing with a deadly disease. It's inevitably fatal. And we're dealing with a disease, let me ask you this, your projections are that it's going to get worse before it could become better, is it not? Right. Do you, do you quarrel with Dr. Hirsch's uh, uh, summary that there are today 10,000 living patients with AIDS, 100,000 with AIDS-related disorders? Is that about right? He's quoting public health service numbers, yes. And only a thousand uh, will be participating in this uh, program. I don't. I don't know if it's only a drop in the bucket, but when you add up your testimony, I think the word disgrace probably applies. Is it your testimony that we are today utilizing? all of the facilities available in America that could provide that kind of controlled uh, research uh, environment? No, we prob probably could do some more. Why aren't we doing it? 